Hi little skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here. Welcome back to another reacting video. So this one is going to be reacting to Disney Harry Potter quiz. So as you guys know, when I do the quizzes, I actually answer along with her, but obviously my results won't pop up because technically I'm not actually taking this quiz. So if you guys don't know how my reacting videos work, I watch Harley Baby's videos, react when I have something to say, and I pause it, and at the end we give an overall score. So, let's get into it. Hey Prince, Harley Baby 45 here. So, my next quiz that I'm going to do is a little different. There's still some Disney in there, but it's also a little bit different because it says everyone is 50% Disney and 50% Harry Potter magical person. Who are you? I'm not a big fan of Harry Potter. Um, I never really have been. I've had people who try to get me into the movies and it just hasn't happened. So this is combining two things that I love. So let's get started. To be fair, she doesn't talk about Harry Potter that much. She really only talks about which house she's in, which she may mention in this video. If she doesn't, I'll tell you guys what it is. What word best describes you? Smart, cool, sporty, adventurous, shy, funny, creative, weird, aggressive. I'd bounce back and forth between creative and aggressive. Weird, I am a pretty weird person. But she's a good weird. Pick a Harry Potter hybrid house. Okay. Ravendor, Slitherpuff, Rifferin, Hufferin, Ravenpuff, Slitherdor, Griffinclaw, Huffledor, or Raverin? Hufferin. Well, I am in Slytherin. Okay, so she does mention it. And my best friend Disney Queen Skelly is Hufflepuff. Hi! But at the same time, I'm a Slytherin, and my hubby is a Gryffindor. Choices, choices, choices. So it's going to be between Slitherpuff and Gryffindor. I'm going to choose Slitherpuff. I beat out the hubby! Which non-magical Disney villain is the best? Gaston, Scar... Hans, Captain Hook, Lots of Hug and Bear, Queen of Hearts, Ernesto de la Cruz, Lady Tremaine, Prince John. Ernesto de la Cruz, definitely. Anybody who knows me knows I hate Gaston with a fiery burning passion. She only took a picture with him at Disneyland because I asked her to. <sighs> but the best? I would have to say... Do, 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 do. I would have to say is Captain Hook. I was about to say, get on with it! <laughs> what, kind of sm what kind of smart do you think you are? Music smart? Math smart? Street smart? Visual smart, people smart, science smart, emotional smart, sports smart, or word smart? Between word, emotional, and people smart. Math is the weakest subject of all time, and anybody who knows me knows I suck at it. <laughs> Human calculator right here. Visual, eh, emotional, definitely not. She's better than she thinks she is with the emotional stuff. Words, I stumble on my words way too much. I would say I'm probably music smart. She is. She definitely is. Which Disney food looks the most delicious? Alright, so what we have here, let's go down the list, shall we? Well, I figured you were going to anyways. So what we have here is, sorry, I'm in the middle, I'm trying to adjust myself on my pillow. You adjust yourself a lot in your videos is the cookies from Alice in Wonderland, the porridge from Mulan, a turkey, which... I'm pretty sure that's from Beauty and the Beast. That or Pocahontas. I can't tell what movie that's from. I know, big fan. 
a croissant, uh, spinach puffs. I feel like I've seen that croissant before, I just can't remember where. Various items, I'm assuming from Beauty and the Beast because it looks like gray stuff. Which is actually really good, but it's mostly white chocolate, so it was kind of meh for me. Gumbo, spaghetti, or cake? For me, it's the cookies from Alice in Wonderland. I would say I have a big sweet tooth, so let's do the cookies from Alice in Wonderland. I'm surprised you wouldn't pick that just because it's from your favorite movie. And which Harry Potter food looks the most delicious? All right, let's break it down. So let's see. Like you weren't going to do again anyways. That just looks like eggs and toast. Butter beer. The cake from the second movie. A chocolate frog. Harry's birthday cake that Hag Hagrid made. That's from the feast. Which looks like such a sweet gesture. Feast at Hogwarts. Those are. I'm pretty sure that's a rack of lamb. Cupcakes that are filled with a sleeping drought. I'm assuming those are also. Oh no, these are from the Weasley's house during Christmas time. Those are mince pies. And chicken from obviously the feast. It's crazy that she knows all this. Um, out of all of these though, I think the not the cupcakes. I think the chicken that Ron's eating looks really good. I would say the mince pies look really good, so I'm going to go get those. And finally, which Disney hero do you relate to? Well, I can't relate to Ian because I haven't seen Onward yet. I have. Elsa, Miguel, Merida, Moana, Hero, Riley, Rapunzel. I would say Riley... Um, for me, I, it's between Ian and Riley. Because I'm always a mixed bag of emotions. Ain't that the truth. Alright. I mean that in the nicest way possible. Merlin and Dumbledore. You're a total risk taker, but in a good way. You never you never put anyone in danger, but you but you're always looking for fun new things to do because isn't life just more exciting that way? People may think you're a bit odd, but that's only because you don't care what they think. I do care what people think. I'm working on that. She is, and she's getting better at it. But this is an interesting combination. This is definitely an interesting combination. So She didn't know what the hell to say. That was the 50% Disney, 50% Harry Potter quiz. If you guys take this quiz... Let me know what your answers would be and what result would you get. I'll tell you when I get there. Thank you so much for watching, Prudence. I love you. So overall, the video was awesome. Um, I will, however, give it a uh, 7 out of 10 just because I'm not a big fan of Harry Potter. But I can, you know what? I can rate this however I want. This is my channel. <laughs> I did still have to turn up the volume a little bit, but headphones help a hell of a lot. Um... Anyways, if you guys have taken the quiz, let her know in her video what results you guys got. Um, I'm definitely going to do so once I take the quiz for myself. But anyways, good job, Harley Baby. 7 out of 10. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, little skeletons. Stay safe. Love you guys.